there's a lot of misunderstanding about how content works in businesses like ours. Hi, this is Mark Silver with Heart of Business. And one of the bigger mistakes is that people, maybe like yourself, are thinking that you have to create content for a large audience. And while a lot of people may eventually see your content, that's not how you create it. When you create content, whether you're making a video like I am right now, or audio, or um, uh, an article, or anything, I want you to remember that it's actually a deeply, or can be a deeply intimate moment that you are actually only producing it for one person, the person who is receiving it. You're not speaking to a group. It's, it can be a hard perspective to hold because it appears that way. You know, I, uh, here at Heart of Business, you know, we have some thousands of people on our email list and, and social media platforms. And so if I wanted to, I could really think about it as if I were on a stage addressing a large group of people. But I'll tell you that even when you're on a stage, <laughs> this is still the secret. The secret. Whatever that word means. Something that's often not paid attention to is that people who are experiencing your content when they're receiving it, they are experiencing it alone. Alone. Even if you're in an audience, there is a connection between you and the person on stage. But especially when you're watching a video or reading an article, it's just you. And so when you're creating content, it's just you and the person you're speaking to or speaking with. And that alone, that shift alone, one will hopefully uh, undo some of the stage fright that comes around creating video, but will also put you into a more intimate space to create something a little bit more vulnerable, a little bit more present, a little bit more connecting. If you're thinking about just talking with one person, somebody that you really care about, somebody you really want to help, that's really the big thing. And I'll tell you spiritually, this is also true. A lot of times what I do when I go to create content is I ask in my heart, can I connect with the heart of the person who will be watching this? Help my heart speak to their heart. Help me feel connected to them. Because creating content is a little strange. You know, I'm walking through the woods, I'm holding this thing in my hand, I'm staring right into the lens. You know, I'm not staring at myself in the screen, I'm staring, I'm, I'm looking right in the lens. You know, but in my heart, if I'm asking to be connected to you, what I'm doing is I'm actually looking you in the eye. And that's what I want you to do. Whether you're writing or video or whatever, is I want you to create content that touches people, that connects with the person who needs to hear you. and that your heart is open enough to receive from them as well. And so when you have something to say, it doesn't matter no, how many other people have said it. It doesn't matter how many other people are teaching what you're teaching or speaking to the issues you're speaking to. When you're in a one-on-one -on -one conversation with someone, it matters, it can land in a different way. And that's what I want to invite you into. Stop thinking of yourself as broadcasting and start creating your content from a more intimate place. Tell me how this affects you. I'm really curious to hear if it shifts your experience or how you approach content. And uh, yeah, because I'm delighted if this is a two-way conversation. <laughs> I do want to hear from you. So blessings to you and your business.